Hey guys, are you aware of the chemicals hiding in your own home? These common household items may seem harmless, but if used or stored improperly, they can actually pose a serious threat to your health. In this video, we'll be discussing the top 10 most dangerous household chemicals that you need to be aware of. From toxic gases to carcinogenic substances, it's important to know what's in your home and how to handle them safely. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into this eye-opening topic together. Number 1. Carbon Monoxide Okay, let's start with a real shocker. Did you know that the silent killer could be lurking in your own home? That's right, folks. I'm talking about carbon monoxide. It's a colorless, odorless gas that is produced when fuels like gas, oil, kerosene, and wood don't burn completely. Now, imagine you're snuggled up in bed, sound asleep, and suddenly you're hit with a headache, dizziness, and nausea. It's not the flu, my friends, it's carbon monoxide poisoning. This sneaky gas can quickly build up in your home and cause serious health problems, even death. So make sure to install a carbon monoxide detector in your home and check it regularly and never use a gas stove or oven for heating. And don't forget to check the description below for some important links and resources. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. Number 2. Lead All right, let's move on to the heavy metal that's not just for your music collection. I'm talking about lead. You might have heard about lead in the news, but did you know it could also be hiding in your home? Lead-based paint was widely used in homes built before 1978, and it can still be found in the old paint layers on walls and doors. And if your home was built before the 1980s, it's possible you have lead pipes bringing water into your home. So what's the big deal with lead? Well, ingesting even small amounts of lead can cause serious health problems, especially in children. It can damage the brain and nervous system, cause learning and behavior problems, and even lower IQ. So make sure to have your home and water tested for lead. And if you do find it, take the necessary steps to remove it. Number 3. Asbestos Let's get down to the nitty-gritty with a mineral that sounds like a superhero, but it's actually a supervillain. I'm talking about asbestos. Now you might be thinking, asbestos? That was banned years ago. Well, yes and no. While asbestos is no longer used in new construction, it can still be found in older homes and buildings as insulation and building materials. And if you think about it, it makes sense. Asbestos was once considered a miracle material because of its heat and fire resistance. But little did we know, inhaling its tiny fibers can lead to lung cancer and other lung diseases. So if you suspect you have asbestos in your home, don't try to remove it yourself. Call in a professional. Trust us, your lungs will thank you. Number 4. Chlorine Okay folks, let's talk about a chemical that's not just for cleaning your clothes, but also for cleaning up your act. I'm talking about chlorine bleach. This common household cleaner is used for a variety of things, from sanitizing your countertops to removing stains from your clothes. But did you know that inhaling its fumes can be harmful to your health? Chlorine bleach releases toxic fumes when mixed with other cleaners, such as ammonia, and can cause respiratory problems eye irritation, and headaches. And if you're pregnant, it's best to avoid it altogether. So be sure to always use bleach in a well-ventilated area and never mix it with other cleaners. And hey, if you want to be extra safe, consider using alternative cleaners made with natural ingredients. Number 5. Ammonia. All right, folks, let's talk about a household chemical that's not just for making fertilizer, but also for making your eyes water. I'm talking about ammonia. This clear, pungent-smelling liquid is commonly used in cleaning products, like window and glass cleaners, and it's also used in the production of household items like textiles, plastics, and fertilizers. But did you know that inhaling its fumes could be dangerous to your health? Ammonia can irritate your eyes, skin, nose, and throat, and even cause coughing and wheezing. And if you mix it with other cleaners, like bleach, it can release toxic fumes that can be harmful to your respiratory system. So be sure you use ammonia in a well-ventilated area, wear gloves and a mask, and never mix it with other cleaners. Number 6. Sodium Hydroxide – Caustic Soda There is a household chemical that sounds like something out of a science fiction movie, but it's actually very real. I'm talking about sodium hydroxide, also known as caustic soda. This powerful alkaline substance is commonly used in a variety of products, including drain cleaners, oven cleaners, and soap making. 
But did you know that coming into contact with it can cause serious health problems? Sodium hydroxide is extremely caustic and can cause chemical burns, eye irritation, and respiratory problems. And if you ingest it, it can cause serious internal damage, including ulceration and perforation of the esophagus. So be sure to handle sodium hydroxide with care, always wear gloves and protective eyewear, and store it out of reach of children. Number 7. Methylene Chloride This colorless liquid is commonly used in paint strippers, metal cleaners, and aerosol propellants. But did you know that inhaling its fumes can be harmful to your health? Methylene chloride can cause dizziness, headaches, nausea, and even unconsciousness in high concentrations. And over time, repeated exposure to its fumes can cause harm to the liver and central nervous system. So be sure to use methylene chloride in a well-ventilated area, wear protective gloves and a mask, and avoid using it in enclosed spaces. And don't forget to hit that like button if you're enjoying the video so far. Number 8. Formaldehyde Formaldehyde this colorless, strong-smelling gas is commonly used in a variety of products, including pressed wood furniture, insulation, and certain cleaning products. But did you know that inhaling its fumes can be harmful to your health? Formaldehyde can cause eye, nose, and throat irritation, as well as headaches and nausea. And if you're exposed to high levels of it over a long period of time, it can increase the risk of certain types of cancer. So be sure to use products containing formaldehyde in a well-ventilated area and consider using alternative products made without formaldehyde. Number 9. Tetrachloroethylene Perchloroethylene Tetrachloroethylene, also known as perchloroethylene, or PCE, for short, is a chemical that's found in some household products and can be dangerous to our health if we're exposed to it for too long. Imagine PCE as a bad guy who wants to cause trouble in your body. Let's give PCE a personality. He's a sneaky fellow who likes to hide in the shadows and wait for his opportunity to strike. He's sneaky because you might not even know he's around, even though he's in some common household items like dry cleaning solvents, spot removers, and even some types of carpet cleaning products. When you breathe in PCE, it can cause headaches, dizziness, and even nausea. That's like PCE sneaking up and whacking you on the head with a frying pan. It can also damage your liver and kidneys if you're exposed to it for too long which is like PCE sneaking up and giving them a good whack with a baseball bat. So, what can you do to protect yourself from PCE? Well, first of all, it's important to know where he might be hiding. Look for products that are labeled as PC-free and try to use them instead of products that contain PCE. You can also make sure you use these products in a well-ventilated area and avoid inhaling any fumes that might be released. That way, you'll minimize your exposure to PCE and keep him from causing any harm. Number 10. Petroleum-based products such as gasoline and kerosene Petroleum-based products such as gasoline and kerosene are commonly used in our households, but they can be dangerous to our health. When gasoline or kerosene is spilled or used in a poorly ventilated area, fumes can be released into the air we breathe. Inhaling these fumes can cause headaches, dizziness, nausea, and other unpleasant symptoms. In severe cases, exposure to gasoline or kerosene fumes can cause more serious health problems such as respiratory distress, eye and skin irritation, and damage to internal organs. In extreme cases, inhaling gasoline or kerosene fumes can even be fatal. It's important to always handle gasoline and kerosene products with care and to use them in a well-ventilated area, away from open flames or sparks, which can cause a fire or explosion. If you do spill gasoline or kerosene, be sure to clean it up immediately and make sure the area is properly ventilated before using any type of open flame or electrical device. And that concludes our top 10 list of the most dangerous household chemicals for human health. I hope this video was informative and helpful to you. If you liked what you saw, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay tuned for more videos like this. We have many more exciting topics lined up for you and our next video is about the top 10 most dangerous cosmetics ingredients for human health. So, stay tuned, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.